At training this Monday, the Toronto Maple Leafs presented TJ Brody and Simon Benoit as the main defense pair. However, Jake McCabe's absence from this training session raises questions about this formation, and the Leafs need to improve. Firstly, the simultaneous presence of Labushkin, Brody, Edmondson and Benoit in the lineup compromises defensive quality, as having four players with puck-moving quality below the NHL standard is not sustainable against competitive teams. Furthermore, TJ Brody seems to no longer have space as a starter on a competitive team. Maybe he can still contribute on the third line, but he's not the best option for the first line right now. With an expected goals rating below 50% through 63 games this season, Brody is no longer a key player for the team. Therefore, the Leafs should take a chance on Timothy Liljegren. Against Montreal in the last game, Liljegren led the team in 5v5 ice time, and will have an expanded role going forward, being the only skilled right-hander on the team. In that sense, Liljegren should partner Jake McCabe in the main defensive pairing. Although Keith has indicated plans for Liljegren to play with Joel Edmondson, it is crucial that he is paired with McCabe as really, and Labushkin need more careful handling. This change is inevitable, and it will happen as soon as Keefe realizes that Brody is no longer contributing like he used to. It's an unfortunate situation, especially since the acquisitions of Brody and Muzzin, in their prime, could have resulted in a Stanley Cup for the Toronto Maple Leafs. Unfortunately, that didn't happen, and now is the time to explore new defensive options.